guys, welcome to Megan and Molly and the show. Uh, today, I am going to show you guys a cool DIY where you can store your markers, your sunglasses on your wall beside your bed where no one can get them. You can put them as high or as low as you want. So, today I'm going to show you and I'm going to put them up in my room. So, the things you will need is a piece of paper, you'll need sellotape, and scissors. So, first of all, you're going to take your paper and your scissors. I've already got some colouring on mine, you might not see that, but I do. Uh, just don't go on the colouring and cut out a square as long or as not long as you want. I'll show you the size of mine in a new minute. Perfect. Get this size. Alright. I'm putting my... T I'm making two. You can make as much as you want. So, I'm making about this size. So, next of all, you're going to take your little piece of paper and your sellotape and I'm going and I'm going to stick it on your wall okay so stick it like corner and corner back in a sec I'm just gonna try I'm just gonna do one thing very quick okay so I'm not gonna show you how I put it up because my battery is very low uh, so I'm going to show you the way I put it up after, okay? So I'm going to stick it up, be back in a sec. So you will just actually want to stick, put it the place on your wall, stick the bottom up here too. But don't sell it at the top because that will be your little entrance. But that's like, the little, it's like a little pouch. Okay, I'll show you when I'm done. I'm really excited to see how this turns out. Okay, guys, so I've stuck mine up, and I'm going to show you how it turned out. So. I haven't stored anything in it yet, but it's on top of my bed. Like, there. Do you think it's cool? So now I'm going to put... A pen in it, to s a few pens, to see how it turns out. Be back in a sec. Okay, so now I'm going to put my things in. Okay, guys. So I had a little accident with mine. I accidentally ripped it when I was putting the thing in. So I'm going to try thin things like a bracelet or a hair bobbin. I'm going to start with the hair bobbin. Okay, the hair bobbin, the hair bobbin did not work. So I'm going to get a little hair clip. I'll show you in a wee minute. So I actually found a good idea, way thinner, something like really thin, like your bobby pins. So I'm going to try them. Okay guys, so the bobby pins worked, I'll show you. See? Yeah, it turned out really well. So if you tried this, don't forget to give a big thumbs up and comment. Uh, and a big thanks to Ema Brennan and Finon Brennan, both twins, um, for coming to me a lot. And uh, don't forget to subscribe to Olivia O'Connor's uh, YouTube channel. They're really good. You might, you might know Tomas O'Connor, Sean O'Connor, Neve O'Connor. Yeah, and um, yeah, Neve was in one of my videos. And uh, don't forget to subscribe to their channel. Just look up Olivia O'Connor. Just check every single one. And that's it. Don't forget to subscribe and comment to their video. Don't forget to subscribe. And don't forget, I'm on Snapchat. It's Mego8. So you can do that too. Uh, yeah, so that's pretty much it. And the shout-outs for this week are, for today, I should say, 
for today are what kind of DIY did you do and how mysterious it is and uh, Finn and Brennan asked me I think I already answered this question but you might have uh, so I'll just answer it again uh, Finn and Brennan asked where did I get the bean boozle in my bean boozle challenge video so I got the bean boozle in Centra I just was looking around for a treat my dad said I could get a treat I was looking around and found the bean boozle I thought oh yeah I'm gonna do this on YouTube and then uh yeah I asked could I buy them and then he said okay yeah so then yeah that's it for today's video don't forget to subscribe and comment and click the thumbs up button. Bye!